Bradley Rowe with the Hoosier Company, and I'd like to welcome you to the field application video for the Night Star Distance Measuring Instrument from Visola. In this video, we'll briefly discuss the operation of the NS50 head unit, as well as the technique for proper field calibration. In the product information video, we discussed the two different sensors that can be used with the Night Star, as well as how those sensors detect the vehicle pulses and translate them into distance traveled. Now let's focus on the NS50 head unit. The first task after securely positioning the head unit in your vehicle is to calibrate the instrument to your vehicle. Begin by locating a calibration course with a precisely known distance. For example purposes, we'll use a course a thousand feet in length. The first step in calibrating your new Night Star is to turn the unit on by pressing the on-off button. Make sure that the instrument is in count hold mode, and when it is, press the one cal key. Confirm 1000 as your temporary calibration number. Your new Night Star will be factory programmed with the calibration number of 1000. This should remain in the Night Star until you have found your vehicle's specific calibration number, as we will explain next. If for some reason 1000 is not programmed in, manually type in 1000 and press the Mark Enter key. The next step is to press the Run Hold key. The display will show that the course length is a thousand feet. If your calibration course is different, enter that length. Next, press the mark enter. The display will show the word roll, telling you that you can start driving the course and your pulse count will be zero. When you start to move, that display will show the pulses counted. Please note, the value that the display shows is pulses counted by the instrument and not distance traveled. Disregard the value and continue to the next step. At the end of the course, stop the vehicle carefully so it's aligned with the end of the course marker. When the car has stopped, press the run hold key and the display will become your calibration number. The final set once the calibration number has been determined, is to press the Mark Enter button, and your calibration number will be stored permanently in the memory. Save this value by turning the Night Star off by pressing the On Off key until all the instruments turned off. If this is the first time you've calibrated a DMI, please repeat the procedure to see that you get the same calibration value. It usually takes some practice to precisely stop and start the car through a calibration course. Remember, your measurements will only be as accurate as your calibration. If you'd like additional information on the Night Star Distance Measuring Instrument, or any other product that we carry at the Hoosier Company, please view the other videos on our YouTube channel. Visit our website at www.hoosierco.com, or give us a call at 317-876-6675.